how to do connection in PGSQL database through PHP. Hi friends and welcome back to SS Text and Creation YouTube channel and today in this video you will see how to do connection with a PGSQL database through PHP. With PGSQL means it's just a Postgres SQL database through PHP and if you want to know how to do connection with a MySQL database then I have already uploaded the video on how to do connection with the MySQL database and in description you will get the link of that videos and okay now but in this video we will see how to do connection with the PGSQL database means postgres sql database okay let's begin with the video here uh, i have one file i have created uh, save that file already that is test.php inside that i will write the code okay let's begin with the code i'm writing the code this is a syntax php syntax inside that only syntax I write a php code and i will just write here any like a uh, dollar of c1 it's just we can say connection variable or we can say object and there's one function like uh, pg underscore connect Okay, this is a function by using that you can do connection with the uh, uh, Postgres SQL database and uh, inside that you have to write here first. Uh, what exactly you have to write here? You have to write here like a uh, host equal to what is a host? Uh, here I will just write your local host, what is your server name you can say. Local host is just host, local host space and after that uh, if there is port, okay, then here also you have to write your port like uh, what is the port like well, suppose the port is 8080 what exactly the port if there is port then you have to write your port also okay after that you have to scan say uh, you have to if the database okay db name okay i am just db name inside that you have to write uh, db database name what is your database name suppose there is a test database name then you have to write your test or what is the database name which you want to do connection then you have to write their database name and after that uh, then there is a user okay what is the user name like uh, now i am studying here post Postgres, okay, Postgres, and after that, uh, password. If there is a password for your database, then you have to write your password. Suppose my password is one two three four five. Okay, this is a password. This things I have written, and uh, and then you have to write a semicolon. Okay, what exactly I have written? I have written a dollar sign. It is just a variable, or you can say connection object. And pg underscore connect. It's a function. By using this, we can do connection with a PGSQL database. First is host. You have to write your server name. That my, my it is whole local host. Port. If there is a port, then you have to write your port. Otherwise, it's not needed. Composite is not. We can remove also. DB name. It's needed because to which we have to do connection. Database name. You have to write here. Whatever database you are using. I am using test. I'm just writing here. This is just example I have doing. User, what is your username? I have here Postgres. Okay. Then password is there is a password for your uh, database or you can say Postgres. So then you have to write your password for that. Okay. And how to check whether the connection is done? Then you have to just write your simple if condition. C O N dollar C O N dollar C O N. Okay. Okay. And uh, you can just write your uh, Connection field. Field. I'm just writing this, and uh, here I'll just write else. Uh, go connected as you successfully. Up. You can see uh, if the connection is failed, then it will print like a uh, connection failed. If connection is not done, if connection is done, then it will print a uh, connected successfully. Okay, see by using this simple eight line code, I have written how to do connection with the MySQL database and oh sorry, MySQL no sorry, PGSQL database. You can say Postgres SQL database. Okay, if you want to do this, and after that, suppose <coughs> if you want to perform some crude operation on this database name like test, what are tables are there? Then what have to do uh, whenever perform some anything like insert select then you have to use this connection object for that and you can perform the uh, you can see crude operations uh, for your database table okay so whatever you are okay uh, this was only the code for doing the connection to the database to, to the pgsql database and thank you so much and for watching my videos and one more thing if you have not subscribed my youtube channel then subscribe now and click on notification icon to get instant notification of uh, of my upcoming videos Till then, bye and take care.